What's up guys? Today we will be reviewing a brand new fishing reel I just got from Cabela's. Really nice one. It's a lose reel and rod combo. Super nice. Uh, yeah, this is it. That's good. You know I've been rocking that other reel for a while now actually and it is not the greatest. I'm just gonna say it. So we got this guy. $200 reel rod combo. Super nice. Go check it out at Cabela's. I'm not sure. I think they sell them online too but I decided to get the right-handed. I know all you anglers out there are like, the left hand is so much better because you can cast them. Right yeah. um, I am right-handed, but lots of people get the left-handed just because, yeah. So I reviewed it. So I went to Silverwood, actually, and I we went to Cabela's on our way there. And so uh, if you don't know what Silverwood is, it's just like an amusement park kind of thing. So I see this at Cabela's, and I'm like, dang, I got to get that thing because I've been needing a new rod, actually, but... I can, I mean, I could always use a nice reel, but, uh, and so I went there, didn't get it, and then on our way back, I had already researched it and stuff for the way back, just because I was like, you know, I might want to get it, and so then I just got it, so, so far, super smooth, I don't know, maybe, yeah. We'll be going fishing with it, oh, said we will be going fishing with it in Moses Lake soon, but I just wanted to make this, so we're going to Moses Lake this weekend, and we're going to use it and stuff, so, yeah, that, I mean, this video is kind of just like, a update i haven't posted in a long time i've been i just got this pc uh a pc i got it all set up for streaming and stuff and my friend is coming over i just got a new case for it like a tower and so he's gonna help me put it all together and stuff so let me know if you guys want me to make that into a video so i, th I think that's probably gonna be like next week maybe but i just wanted to review this uh rod really quick you know just because i got it and i thought that it would be cool to review this is what we were going to be using um, just a Guggen Squad Texas rig. Here, what that? This, uh, this is what I got. So, for my birthday, I got a gift card for Hooked on Toys. I've, it's it's kind of like just like a sporting, I don't know how to explain it, just fishing, sporting, all that kind of fun stuff. So, I decided to get this for my $40. I got some, okay, yeah, let, me, let me just do a review. So, I got this, which I think is going to be a game changer. So, you load it up with every, whatever you need. It has a perfect amount of space. That way you're not clunking around a massive, unless you're on a boat, obviously. But like, if you're fishing shore, you're gonna want this guy right here. Cause you just, you don't need two ro ro reel rods. You know, you just get one, you just get one reel or rod or whatever you want to call it. And you just go out, bring one of these guys. You got all your lures. So this is what I loaded up with. So I got one set of Guggen baits. Uh, Crack and cry, I don't know. I've used them before, they're pretty nice. And then I decided to get these, and because I wanted to, I've never used a wacky rig, so I decided I wanted to do a wacky rig, but I forgot to get the, um, I forgot to get the freaking hooks. So, <clears throat> this is the line we are rocking on it. I know you guys are probably saying braid's the best. I used braid for a while, I like braid, you know, don't get me wrong, I like braid. It just doesn't seem as smooth to me, all right? It doesn't seem as smooth and nice to me, okay? Don't get mad at me. Just my thoughts. But, and it is super annoying because you got to carry a lighter around with you or something like that to get the braid off of. You can't just bite it off like monofilament. So, then in here you have all of these little guys right here that you can put your anything you want. Like, you can put some different little snips for uh, cutting your line or getting hooks out of fish or... or what is actually, I mean, it's kind of meant for is like power bait or worms or something, you know, something like that. You know, you put your power bait, you can line this thing up with power bait. But <clears throat> probably not going to use it for power bait because I'm kind of more into bass than trout. But like, we do go up into a lot of trout places and this is going to be great to have because you just got. So I'm in Wenatchee right now. I have all of my, I already have most all this stuff in Moses Lake, but I just decided to get this stuff. Just for Wenatchee, because um, there is, I know there is bass fishing in Wenatchee. I just haven't really done it, because, I mean, obviously, Moses Lake, way better. But, like, yeah, I just decided to review this. Then I got some bullet heads, you know, just normal bullet heads. And then I got, let me check. I got, <clears throat> one I got these hooks. They were recommended for these type right here. But, so, I just got these just for Texas rig, because I decided, you know, Texas rig, you can't really go wrong with it. You can, honestly, I didn't know how to swim a Texas rig before, and I would just straight retrieve it, and, like, the 
the thingies on these would be, you know, like flapping. And I caught fish on that. So, I mean, I'm just saying, it, I mean, they work for a lot of things. And then I, this is just something I set it up just because, you know, I thought I may as well set it up. So, I don't know if I'm doing Texas rig right, okay? So, this is this is what happens to me. I don't know. Here, one second. Let me. So, this is up. how I do my Texas rig. My phone died. That's why I, I, that's why I just repositioned. But, because it's plugged in. But, so... I don't know. I think I actually did it right. This is my best one, I think, yet. Because it looks very straight and you know, kind of thing. But I've never actually used a worm like this. So I'm hoping this kind of works. I'm, I I just have a feeling you like let it sit on there and then you just like twitch it. Because I've watched some videos like that. But that's why I really want to try a wacky rig. Because, I mean, I've seen people fish with it. And it kind of works in any scenario, I feel like, you know. Especially, I mean, I meant for like bass, you know. It works for any scenario with a bass. So, yes. I'm just going to be fishing with this kind of stuff in Moses Lake. I'm not going to use any, uh, like, Rapalas or anything like that. Like, because I usually use Rapalas and stuff like that. But I'm just deciding to use this type of stuff today. And, like, a Texas rig. Love Texas rig. Ever since I've used them, always loved them. But I'm kind of more into the Rapala game. Kind of, you know, just, or the, anything kind of like that. Because, I don't know. It's just, I feel like, easier. I mean... Not easier, but you don't really have to, like, mess with it as much, you know? You don't have to, like, jig it off the ground. You can kind of just straight retrieve. But, I mean, that's what I do. I don't know. I'm probably maybe doing it wrong, but... Yeah, I don't know. Leave, leave it down in the comments. It's just a short video, hopefully. I'll be seeing you guys soon. I'm going to be doing some bass fishing in Moses Lake soon, so stay tuned for that. And I'm sorry for not making any youtube videos lately i've just been very busy so have a nice day and i'll see you in the next i'm really one. looking for a sponsor i know i literally don't have any subscribers but like i think a sponsor would be a great way to kind of start kicking off my youtube i'm kind of doing this as for fun now i mean if i get lucky i can start making some money off it but i mean the chances of that are like one in a million but I'm really looking for a sponsor though. I think that would be a great thing. I don't have to get paid for it. I will just sponsor your video, or sponsor your product, any product, doesn't matter. It could be fishing, hunting, any gear. If you're some small product that kind of wants to start getting it, you know, wow, I don't know why I said that. Um, just, I will literally do anything. I mean, it might not help your product, but it's like, you're not even having to pay me. I will just like, I'll use it in my video. It'll help me. It might help you. I don't know. But I, I, I'll i send the product back if you don't want me to keep it. Like, I'll do it for free. That's, like, basically free energy, er, uh, free commercial. I don't know. But, yeah, thank you. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Sorry, I already made my outro. But, yep.